today I'm going to be removing the standard headlight bulb from my bike. A couple of reasons. It's quite yellow. I don't like the colour very much. I don't think it's a very good headlight. And also I've read up quite a lot that these headlight bulbs get quite hot and they can actually crack the plastic. So I'd rather replace it with an LED anyway. So I'm going to walk you through it. Um, I'm not going to spend a lot of time on how to remove the unit um, itself because there are many videos out there. But you just need a 3mm and 4mm Allen key. The only difference on my bike is I have a meter visor from Motorzar. Um, I find it's really good on the bike. It has a plastic panel which basically goes over the original. So you would undo your, nor your bolts as per normal on the top here. Give it a little pop up and remove that. Once you remove the panel underneath, there are two, these are the 4mm Allen head bolts. So we just, obviously you'll be unscrewing them. I've already done that to save a little bit of time. There we go. Next thing to do, a little bit awkward to, probably to find on the camera, but in here, I just try and get it to zoom in. There we go. There's a little push on it. And all you need to do is that very centre part. Just pop in with a screwdriver. You feel a click. There we go. And then you can get a finger just underneath it, and you can wiggle it out like so. You can do that on both sides. Put this down. There we go. Find a little clip. Finger under. Pop it out. There we go. And drop it on the floor. Yeah, just found there somewhere. There we are. Now you can literally drop your headlight cover down. There's a little clip there, it's just push in at the top and that will pull straight out. There we go, look, there you are. Unit drops down a bit further. We can undo our H4 connector. Just wiggle it off. There we go. Now at the bottom corners, there are two little rubber pegs. So what you can do, if you're lazy like me, just give it a tug to the whole unit off itself. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to take it in the house now and I'm going to show you how to the bowl. Okay, so we're in the house now. It is November in England and it is bitterly cold outside, which is why I decided to bring this indoors. So this is the unit as I took it off. First thing you want to do is remove your rubber cover from around your original bulb. Set that to one side. And then you've got a little clip there you just push down, which will release it. Flick it over, out of the way, and remove your bulb. Simple. Now the bulb I'm replacing it with is one of these LED perf bulbs. Um, I did look for an oversight. Um, everyone seems to be using those on the GSXS 750s. However, I couldn't seem to source one very easily, so I went with a different bulb. Um, a bit surprised when it arrived because it's got quite a chunk of wiring to it and an internal fan, so it's slightly different, which is why I wanted to do this video today. The instructions, pointless. Just get rid of them. So what we want to do, we get the bulb out itself. I've seen a few different videos on these where people have taken off this ring, which is the first thing you do need to do. They've then put the rubber boot onto here and then spent 20 minutes trying to fiddle around in here, trying to work out how to actually get it to go in and close. Now there is a fairly simple solution which I've come up with and it is a case of, let's see if I can actually undo this one handed, I might have to put the camera down if not. Yeah, it's coming off, that's good. Okay, take the ring off. Okay, it's got a top marked quite clearly. What we're gonna do, is we put the ring straight in. Okay, so put the ring straight in there and then close it. So, there we go, that's clipped nicely. And then make sure that these legs are just slightly out of the way. 
because what we're going to do is we're actually going to put the rubber boot over here rather than actually on first. So give me just a second and I'll get the rubber boot. So here's the rubber boot. If ever you, you're concerned about the orientation, it does, it has actually writing on the top of it. So that goes at the top, quite simply, of the headlight. So what I'm doing is just push the middle bit over and seat it right down in there. Okay, it will go. It'll go lovely and flush like so. What that means is you've just not spent 20 minutes of your time faffing around trying to work out how to do it. And then just push the rubber surround around until it all feels nice and seated and tight. There we go, that feels pretty good all the way around. So one last feel. There we go. Then it's as simple as take the bulb, there's an arrow, the arrow goes right at the top. And then all we do is push it right in nice and tight. And that is how you fit the LED Perf headlight bulb in the simplest way possible. What I'm going to do is I'm just going to make sure it's all aligned correctly because if I turn the light over, you will see there is an arrow and then there's an internal arrow. So I do need to make a teeny adjustment there. Once I've made the adjustments, we'll get back to the bike and we'll put it on. Okay, so back outside now, I've got the two lugs back in situ now. I have put the H4 connector, I have just plugged it in because a bit trying to video with one hand and plug that in with the other, I just didn't think it was gonna work. So it's really just a case of getting everything back in place, redoing your little clip there, and then bolting it all up. Um, I am gonna need my hands, so I'm gonna take a second and just do that. So putting it together was the complete opposite of taking it apart. It was very simple, straightforward. As you can see, I haven't really put the bolts in the top yet. Uh, the reason being is I did order some side light LED bulbs for over those sides. Um, they haven't arrived yet, but it's also nice because you can see the comparison because those bulbs are the same colour the original headlight bulb was. So let's crank the lights on. And look at that. Night and day difference. Absolute clear light. I'd definitely say it's a brighter light. Hopefully this video will help you. Um, if you have any questions, just put in the comments box. Thank you.